one and all, and welcome to Tom's Hit Parade. This is just going to be a quick little channel chatter type of video, just going to talk about a couple things. Uh, and yes, I realize I just did a channel chatter video almost exactly one month ago, and no, this is not going to be a regular monthly thing, at least I'm not intending it to be. Uh, I just wanted to talk a little bit about a couple of things uh, that have been on my mind lately. And I actually, for the first one though, uh, I found out about this actually after I decided I was going to do this video, so it's just a little extra thing. I have reached the milestone of 50 subscribers. Not a huge milestone, no, but uh, hey, I'm happy. I Honestly, I, I'm totally jazzed about this. It took me a while to get there. It uh, took a year and a half for me to get here, but I am not complaining at all. Uh, honestly, I really only ever intended for this channel to be a hobby. I mean, I've got a day job, and you know, so... And I honestly, I don't know that I would really want to make this a, a profession, you know, to, to ha have to have this to be something I make a living at, like, you know, ARTV and uh, Spectrum Pulse. They're doing it. They're pulling it off. You know, more power to them. I love them. But honestly, I have this fear that if I were to make this, you know, my bread and butter, the stuff that pays my bills, uh, it would put so much pressure on it that it would probably take a lot of the fun out of it for me. So... I am honestly glad that this is just a hobby for me. Uh, I am pleased as punch, beyond pleased as punch, to have 50 subscribers. I'd love to have a lot more. I Honestly, I'm kind of comfortable, more comfortable with the slower growth in subscribers that I've had, rather than to have an explosive thing. I mean, the main reason a lot of people get on YouTube is to have a whole bunch of subscribers, and, you know, hey, if I have that, great, eventually, in, in its own time. But, you know, hey, if I only stay at 50 subscribers till the end of time, hey, I have no problem with that. Uh, first of all, I want to thank you all so much for being subscribers, all 50 of you. I really appreciate it. Uh, tell your friends about me. Let's let's ramp up that subscriber count, why don't we? Uh, I've, I have had a modest surge in subscribers this month, uh, probably thanks to the recent Skip Herman's interview that I did this past week. And also, perhaps, uh, thanks to the kind words of Wouter Hamill himself. After I posted my review of his album, he contacted me personally to thank me profusely. I mean, I've never had that sort of contact directly from an artist before, so he is, hey, hey, he's number one in my book right now, okay? Uh, I just, I, I love his music, obviously, and so this just makes him such a cool person in my eyes that uh, thank you, Wouter, and thank you for putting the word out about my channel. It's, it's helped me gain uh, a few subscribers, so... But hey, let's keep on trucking, bringing that subscriber count up a little bit more, okay? Now, one person I want to give particular thanks to, and this is going to seem a little unexpected because I don't think he's even a subscriber to my channel, so he's probably not going to see this, but still, I wanted to give him a little shout-out just because he helped me in some small part to make this channel what it is. And that is a British YouTuber by the name of Ben Simpson. Now, he YouTubes. He's part of the vinyl community on YouTube, uh, although lately he hasn't been doing... Uh, as many videos about music, or vinyl specifically, as he does about uh, horror movies. That's kind of a thing of his lately, uh, horror movies on DVD and Blu-ray. But he did a video, this was about a year ago, uh, just a couple months into me doing my channel, where he was talking about record collecting, and he injected the video with some humor, you know, some awkward humor, some, uh, uh, what, do I, what do you call it, self-deprecating kind of humor, and that really that hit me for some reason. If you've seen my first, you know, 10 or 12 videos, they were really kind of stiff and boring and stuff, and I wasn't really putting a whole lot of my personality into them. But watching that video, I, I loved it. I thought it was hilarious. And so that kind of inspired me. Hey, I don't take myself too seriously, so I'm going to try that on my channel. And it just kind of evolved into this kind of looser, showing you more of my personality in my videos, uh, which I think has kind of given me a little bit of a unique presence on YouTube, even though it's uh, more or less unnoticed. But uh, yeah, so I wanted to thank Ben Simpson. Uh, if you go, if you, any of you out there are uh, communicate with him regularly, you know, turn him onto this video. Just let him know that I appreciate his small little contribution. He probably doesn't even remember it. But uh, yeah, it really kind of helped me change course on this channel to uh, let loose and have fun with it, uh, which is really was the intent on it all along. So thank you, Ben Simpson, and thank you all of my 50 subscribers and my subscribers in the future, people who watch my videos but don't subscribe yet. Uh, hit the subscribe button. Come on. Uh, but anyway, thank you all for watching and supporting, commenting, liking, all that other stuff. But anyway, on to the meat and potatoes, so to speak, of today's video. 
Uh, those of you who are long-time subscribers, uh, you know that this has been an unusually active month on my channel. Uh, it's only the midpoint of June, and I've already posted more videos this month than I do in a full month, usually. Uh, I usually, usually only do one a week. But anyway, uh, and I'm not done yet, actually. I still need to do the Backtracks and Bargain Bag videos for the month of June. Uh, those are monthly uh, staples on my channel, and I don't want to uh, discontinue those. I'm still having too, way too much fun doing those. Uh, but also, I still want to review at least a couple of albums uh, very, very soon here on my channel, in, in, within the next couple of weeks. And I'm also thinking about doing a video for Pride Month in recognition of Pride Month. I did one last June, and June, of course, is Pride Month. So uh, I'm hoping to do one of those. It's going to be a relatively simple one, but, you know, if I have the time, we'll see. Uh, and there's also one that I'd like to do, I really want to do at the end of the month as a, a kind of a surprise. I don't want to tell you what it is yet. So, uh, But those two, those last two that I mentioned, are kind of at the bottom of the list in what I want to do. It's, uh, you know, let me get to the point here. Uh, well, I said I talked a minute ago about the interview video. As much fun as that was, it was very labor-intensive, much more labor-intensive than I thought it was going to be, especially the editing. Now, I love the editing. It could be, uh, when I think about it, the favorite part of uh, doing videos. Uh, I mean, I'll sit at, I'll sit down at the computer to start editing, and I think it's been 15 or 20 minutes, and when I look at the clock, three hours have gone by. That's how much I enjoy the editing and really, you know, putting the finishing touches on the videos and all that. But, yeah, these videos were very, very labor-intensive, a lot more intricate detail in them than I thought, and I wanted to stick to the schedule, you know, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday last week to post the videos. Well, I stayed up until 11.30 Thursday night, to get that Friday upload ready. Uh, it just consumed so much more of my time than I thought I would. I've fallen behind on my YouTube watching. I'm mostly caught up on that by now. Uh, I fell way behind on my album listening. I've got a bunch of stuff to, I haven't listened to yet. I picked up an album last week. Uh, it actually was delivered in the mail that I've literally waited six years for, and I still haven't set aside time to listen to it. And it's actually one of the ones that I want to review uh, upcoming here that I was just mentioned. So. And, you know, aside from all the YouTube stuff, I've got, you know, my regular life stuff, you know, my day job, my paying job, uh, then the regular household stuff, you know, the coming home from work, you've always got chores, you know, dinner, dishes, all that crap, you know, and uh, other miscellaneous household stuff. I've been helping my brother re-roof the house over the last few weekends. You may have noticed some background noise in a few of my recent videos, like the intros and outros of my uh, interview videos. You might have heard some thumping and banging up on the roof. That was my brother up there re-roofing the house. He's needed my help with certain aspects of that over the last few weekends. And then, as if all that weren't enough, we had a minor medical crisis uh, last Sunday. A family emergency sort of thing. Uh, we spent a half a day in the hospital, but don't worry, everybody's okay. Uh, it was just, at first, we thought it was going to be a major, major thing. Uh, so major that I thought I was going to have to put out the dreaded no YouTube videos until further notice announcement. Yeah, that's how huge it was at first, but as I said, it ended up being a relatively minor thing. But still, it you know something like that, especially the impact of when it hits you at first, you think it's going to be huge. It felt like a punch in the gut. Uh, you know, it really took the wind out of me. Uh, through my whole the whole rest of my week was just kind of a blur in some ways. You know, kind of a, kind of chaos, uh, and it, it kind of took me most of the week to recover. I frankly, I don't know how I actually managed to get. Uh, those video interview videos up and when I did uh, posted on schedule like I did so but anyway what I'm trying to say here long story to make a long story even longer I'm exhausted okay you know just you know all this stuff going on and and yes with my YouTube schedule more packed than usual of course granted I didn't realize that this life stuff was going to happen you know at the beginning of the month naturally so uh, but yeah uh, I just, I need to take a break here. Uh, it's not going to be right away. It's not going to be until at the end of the month. Like I said, I want to do these uh, last few videos that I've got in mind, these four, three or four videos. But yeah, uh, what I'm trying to say here is probably at the beginning of July, I'm going to be taking a little break a week, maybe two weeks. Uh, yeah, I just need to chill out, uh, maybe catch up on my album listening. So yeah, my life totally won't be without music. It never is. Uh, but yeah. Just kind of, I need to slow things down a little bit, uh, recover from all this chaos that's been going on. The roof should be done by the end of this month. So, uh, and yeah, uh, like I said, the medical crisis is over with. There's been a little uh, a takeaway from that. So uh, we've done corrective measures. 
with regard to that. That's what I'm trying to say here as I'm rambling. But yeah, uh, just so you know, I will be taking a break at the end of June uh, for the first week and possibly two of July. But uh, yeah, until then, keep enjoying the content. Uh, thank you again for all my subscribers. You guys are wonderful. Uh, keep the comments coming. Keep the likes coming. Uh, let me know what you think of the channel and my content. Uh, if there's anything you'd like to see, I'm not big on taking suggestions. I mean, I will read and listen to every suggestion that I get. It's just, you know, don't guarantee that I'm going to actually follow up on them because, you know, I, I like to do what I want to do. I want to keep this channel me as much as possible. That's what I'm trying to say here. But anyway, enough with my rambling. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I appreciate the feedback, whether about this video or anything on my channel or about music in general. As I said, I'd love to hear from you in the comment section below. I invite you to subscribe to my channel as well and check out my past videos to see what you might have missed. I'm also on Twitter, and you can find the link to my Twitter feed in the description below, so check it out and follow along. Also, please take the time to visit my friends and fellow YouTubers' channels, which are also linked to in the description below. They're all great at what they do, and they're very much worth your attention. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time, and remember, life's too short to be a music snob.